Welcome to Trivia Night. Voted most painful quiz show seven straight years. Or at least that's what I'm going for. Please fill out a comment card and rate your experience. I'm going to ask you a bunch of trivia questions. If you get a question wrong, you have to fight for your life in one of my super fun mini games. If you do badly in the mini game, I'll kill you. But don't worry, ghosts can still win the game. When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round where the living and dead compete to see who can escape first. But enough of me jawing on, let's get to the game! First question. Look, I may be a sociopath, but even I cry during Pixar movies. What does the A and Wally stand for? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Which means only you. I have a surprise for you. Welcome to the killing floor. We're going to play the finger cutting game. My collection is running a little low. Just choose one of your fingers to cut off. End of instructions. Chop. Drop. Cut them off with a big old chop. Ah! Thanks for the finger food. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I don't eat them. I know where they've been. Here's everybody's scores. It's a good way to compare yourself to others and maybe start to feel bad about yourself. Next question. If you are my book club, you know this, but... Who wrote a children's book titled, If Roast Beef Could Fly? <laughs> Who said... This one? The rest of you, come with me. Hello, guten tag. Welcome back to the killing floor. We're going to play chalices. I've given all the safe players a bit of poison to use. Pick a chalice to put your poison in. Now it's your turn to play. Pick a chalice to drink from. And don't slurp when you drink. That drives me nuts. Good to the last drop. If you know what I mean. Now let's see what everyone drank. What? No one drank any poison? Wonderful, now I've got all this chalice poison just sitting here. Here's how all the scores are looking. Let's try another one. An enophile is a connoisseur of what? And the correct answer is... This. The rest of you, I want to show you something. Okay, okay, fine. We'll do some math. Now get off my back. Yeesh. Answer as many math questions as you can before time runs out. If you do the worst, you die. Time to get your math on. Four, six, three, ten, ninety-three, nine. <laughs> Isn't that so annoying? You're approaching the math finish line. Ah! Here it comes. Looks like somebody's a ghosty ghost. But don't worry, ghosts love trivia party games, so you're still in this. You haven't lost or anything. Even death doesn't get you out of trivia murder party. Hey, did anybody hear that? 
I think the squirrels are back in the attic. Ugh, this is what it's like to be a homeowner, kids. Let's try another one. What color is the ribbon on Eeyore's tail? Who picked this one? Lame. All right, next question. And now, for the worst pain of all, obscure baseball facts. Which of these teams was the original Murderer's Row? still alive. I have a surprise for you! Look at that! A pile of money on the floor! That's my third favorite thing to have a pile of. Take as much money as you want, but take the most money or the least money, and you'll be sorry. Get to grabbing! just how greedy you little monsters are. Uh-oh. The most greedy and least greedy must be punished. Personally, I never touch any paper money because of the germs. more questions for you. Who performed a one-man show called Dress to Kill? <laughs> and the correct answer is... this one? You're in for a treat. I want to see you spell. Use letters to spell the longest word you can before time runs out. My ransom letters could use a little bit more pizzazz. Don't be the person with the shortest word or you'll regret it. Spell words now. By the way, the letters don't have to be touchy. And don't forget to press submit when you're done. Let's see what you did there. Uh, that's not how you spell that. Brace yourself. Shoot, I forgot to pick up the coffee filters. Sorry, I don't know why that popped into my head. I should probably run out after I'm done with you. How about this? Which economist introduced the invisible hand metaphor? <laughs> Who picked this? Let's go someplace fun. You can attack someone else. You can defend yourself. Or you can grab some money. And if no one gets hurt, I will still punish someone. Now go say hello to some people with your fists.
real paranoid move to defend yourself even though no one attacked you. Your cowardice must be punished. <laughs> You can check out the full explanation of my tiebreaker rules over on my website. Well, unless it's been hacked again. Thanks a lot, Anonymous. If that's your real name. And it really just makes you feel so helpless when that happens, but, you know, what are you gonna do? There are just bad people in this world. Here's another one. Bleecker Street is part of what famous neighborhood? <laughs> and the correct answer is... This one. Let's go someplace fun. Uh-oh, this is a mess. There's blood all over this art. This keeps happening to all my art. Memorize the pattern of blood. All right, that's enough time. Oh man, I am parched. I'm really bad at remembering to stay hydrated. Just a second while I have a little water. <sighs> okay, sorry about that. Anyway, reproduce the pattern on your device by tapping on all the spaces that were red. Then press submit when you're done. The person who is furthest from the pattern will die. Here's that art again. Let's see if you messed it up. Perfect scores all around. It's just gonna make killing you sweeter down the line. Let's try this again. Which of the following novelty songs actually received a Grammy nomination? And the correct answer is... this. Let's play a game. Let's test your memory. Everyone gets to play this time. Memorize the pattern. Okay, you've had enough time. Speaking of memories, I can never remember the difference between an alpaca and a llama. Llamas are smaller and have shorter ears, right? Oh wait, I think I just got that backwards. Or did I? I, I honestly don't know. See what I mean? Alright, let's see how you'll do. From left to right, what was the order of the weapons? If anyone does better than you, I will kill you. was the pattern. How close did you get? You got it exactly right. Ugh, let's see how your friends did. We'll get you next time. Okay, this next question is really good. Uh-oh, did you hear that? Sounds like the police are closing in. Time for a slight change of plans. No more Mr. Nice Guy for me. It's time to kill all but one of you. That's why you're all gonna take turns spinning the loser wheel. 
Let's go in order, starting with the least money. Nobody keeps the loser wheel waiting. Nobody. Yeah. Oh, I just love it when she spins. Well, you had a fair shot. It just didn't work out. Ah! Who's next? Go ahead. Give it a big spin. Ah! Spin, spin, spin. I am just as shocked as you are. Just one of you left. We did it, everyone. Now come with me. I saved the best for last. Congrats on making it here alive. Now let's see if you can escape with your body. I'm going to give you a category. Democrats. Tap on each answer that fits, then press submit. Let's see the right answers. You move forward one space for every correct answer. You're getting real close to the exit! Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If a ghost catches up to you, then they will steal your body. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Sergeant Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band. Can you stay out of the shadows? Mortal Kombat characters.
Hi, the party's downstairs. Come on in.